Well, it wasn't the Mother's Day she was expecting. A Valley Center mom gives birth in her own driveway before she could get to the hospital. Cakes Deb Ferris met with the family of Via Christi St. Joseph and shows us that baby and mom are doing just fine. Baby Serrato wasn't due until May 23rd, so this couple wasn't too worried about him being born yet. But this morning, baby Eric decided to come early. Little Eric Serrato came in at 6 pounds, 14 ounces, and 20 inches long. And a lot of hair. Yeah. <laughs> That's probably why I had all that heartburn. <laughs> and baby Eric has quite the story. Mom Christy began having contractions at home near Valley Center early this morning. At 7, her water broke. She got into the family truck hoping to get to the hospital. I reached down below and I can touch, I was touching something round. I was like, okay, that's the head. And, and like maybe within five minutes, baby was born. Dad Joel did what he could to help. Dad pulled him out. I told him rush into the house, grab some scissors, grab that uh, suction, and he cut the umbilical cord and I uh, cleaned out, you know, his mouth and his nose and baby was crying and I already had him in my arms. The new family then headed toward the hospital but only made it to Ridge and K96 before Christy had to call 911. My baby's born and I have him in my arms already. I can hear him crying, that's good. I'm sending the paramedics to help you now. Okay. Baby Eric is doing just fine, resting in the hospital with plans to be home to meet his two older brothers just in time for Mother's Day. But now knowing that I'm going to, you know, that I have him here for Mother's Day, what better gift, you know, than to have it for Mother's Day, have all my kids with me, so. At Via Christi St. Joseph, Deb Ferris, Cake News. And what a special oh, Mother's Day it will be. I love that little Eric is so cute. He's so adorable. She seems like she's doing great. Both yeah. uh, mom, baby. And look, props to dad for grabbing the scissors. and You taking said you would have passed out. I would have passed out long before. <laughs> I don't blame you. Absolutely. <laughs>